Hi Playgroup friends, it's more Rachel here. I hope you guys are having a really nice day. So today I wanted to talk to you guys about spring. Spring is when the weather gets really nice and a lot of trees start growing back their leaves and they also have some flowers growing on them and the grass gets longer and you see different flowers on the grass. And I thought that we could make some flowers today as a, an art project. Um, so what we're gonna need is paper, um, some paint, um, some paintbrush, um, there's going to be two ways we can do it. So um, we can either use paintbrushes or we can use a plate and just pour the paint on the plate. And um, last but not least, a uh, potato. Um, so I'm using a potato because I want to do something out of the box and something that um, the kids can grasp. Uh, and also the potatoes are going bad, so I wanted to use them. Um, so this is this part is for the parents. Um, what I want uh, you guys to do is to kind of make these little um, shapes on the potato. Well, first of all, cut them in half and then make these like little triangle shapes. Um, they're gonna almost look like tulips when you um, stamp them on the paper. Um, so they're gonna need your help with this part. But after that, the kids can um, obviously do it on their own. This is great for the kids' hand-eye coordination. It's great for their creativity. Um, you can ask them questions about the colors and you guys can even take them for walks and um, you know point out to the different flowers that they see and maybe they're gonna wanna do those same colors. Um, uh, it's also great for their fine motor skills because regardless of how they do the project with the paintbrushes or with um, putting the paint, putting the potato on the paint and then stamping it on the paper. Um, they're using, you know, their fingers and stuff. Uh, so let's get started. First is we're just going to take some green paint and we're just going to make lines um, for the for the stems of the flowers. So since there's two ways we can do this, the first way is by pouring some paint onto a plate and then taking the potato and putting it on the paint like this and then stamping it on the paper. And the second way we can do it is, is by dipping our paintbrush in any color that we want. I'm gonna pick a nice purple and we're gonna paint it on the potato and we're gonna make sure there's a lot of paint on the potato. Like this. And then we're going to press it onto our paper. We're gonna do one more. Um, I think what we're going to do is a different color. We're going to do orange. And now we're going to stamp it on our paper again. And there we go. We have some flowers. Thanks everyone, bye.